One day ago, the Legionnaires of Christ, a religious order in the Catholic Church, released a 25-page report on the abuse suffered in the religious order, uh, not only by different members of clergy and other religious brothers, but by uh, Marcial Maciel, the founder of the religious order. And they found that at least 60 boys had been reported to have been abused by the founder of the Legionnaires of Christ. The Legionnaires of Christ is a Catholic religious order that has been known to be very conservative, also to be very strict on rules, especially when it comes to recruiting. And when the Legionnaires have previously recruited, they start with uh, recruiting teens and send them away to like boys schools type deal where they recruit them early and actually go and talk to their parents and send them away to Catholic schools, which I will be talking about their different rules in the next video. But for this video, the Legionnaires of Christ released a report talking about how 60, bu 60 boys were abused by this uh, Catholic priest, and they talk about how all the different minors over the years have been abused from 1941 to 2019. They talk about how the abuse occurred with uh, 11 to 16 year olds. Uh, usually when we think of pedophiles, we think of people with uh, abusing small children, but in the recent reports in the Catholic Church, which we've seen in the John Jay report, and also uh, just in different reports of abuse, we find that the abuse occurs with the uh, teenagers in the ages of 11 to 16. But when we think of uh, pedophiles, or the proper name is pedophile, uh, we think that they are the younger kids, but they're actually either before, slightly before or after the time they hit puberty. So, um, and this is a continue of cover-up in the church where until 2006, um, the accusers weren't believed. The Vatican uh, dismissed, you know, the allegations by the students because Maciel was sending a lot of money to Rome. So this is how it works. The when there's any abuse in the church, the it comes along with power and money. You have to follow the money. And because Maciel was, you know, raising so much money for his religious order, and then giving uh, money to the Vatican, why wouldn't you look the other way? Because you know all is right. And you know, in 2006, when these when these men reported this. Uh, this is shortly after the Charter for the Protection of Children and Young People that was put forth in 2002 by the uh, USCCB. This is shortly after the priest scandal. So in 2006, and even to now, we are still seeing the um, continued cover-up by the bishops around the world. So 2006 was not uh, too far off from the pre-scandals in 2002 and so um, but now we are just now realizing that the bishops who were meant to protect us from you know in 2002 they were meant to get expo get all those bad priests out and expose them and but now we're realizing that the abuse has continued and it has also continued to be covered up by bishops. So this report, it's only, you know, 25 pages, but, uh, you know, this is a this is something by the legionnaires to, to save face for the religious order, uh, to help their recruitment. And, um, you know, do they really want to get down to, you know, why the abuse happened? Maybe. I mean, you know, the good priests want to, but the, um, you know, there's still abusers, I'm sure of, in, in the legionnaires, but 
the problem is we have to get these people out of the church. We have to have our bishops stop covering up for these people. And the abuse happens when a prominent leader has power, has money, has influence in the church. With that comes along, with that comes uh, cover-ups, and it needs to stop. So this is just one incident of of a wave of cover-ups that we're going to see within the next, you know, 20 to 30 years, especially within the next 10 years, especially because of McCarrick, you know, the summer of shame. And we're seeing abuse cases all around the United States now being uncovered where we thought that the bishops in 2002 were going to take care of the problem, but they continued to cover it up. 